Pay attention and listen because NASA found heaven using the Hubble telescope. Look. Hey, the Hubble telescope launched back in 1990. Four years later, 1994, we get that image right there. Okay, you know, shot back down to Earth from the Hubble telescope. Now, what did NASA do? Of course, they tried to hide it, but it didn't work. Now, by the way, that picture right there, my uncle gave me that picture. Um, it was taken by a photographer at Ellington Airfield of the Hubble telescope. You know, you guys know my uncle worked at NASA, and he told me that NASA, you know, does in fact try to hide images and anomalies from the public okay i just wanted to include that little tidbit of information in my video today by the way my microphone shorted out i'm using a different microphone guys so but check it out i mean look you can see towers pillars caves i mean it looks like a man-made building okay this galactic city in the middle of the universe I mean, this is mind-blowing. Like, you know, I thought it was fake, but this, like I said, guys, this is a real NASA image leaked to the public. And I don't know why I've never heard about it. I was watching another channel last night, and they covered the topic here, and I was blown away. I mean, it's quite beautiful, actually. And the crazy thing is, okay, when it was leaked back in 1994, it was one day after Christmas. So was that intentional? You know, because they're calling it, you know, the city of God, you know, so to me, I mean, I don't know, was that someone at NASA that, uh, you know, one of, is basically trying to send us, you know, the American people, the earth, the world for that, for you know, the world, really, when we're talking about the Hubble telescope, are, are they trying to send us a message? I mean, what are we looking at here, guys? Crazy. I mean, uh, it reminds me of, like, ancient ruins, like, on Mars or the moon or, you know, uh, or any planet for that matter. But but check it out. And it has, like, these weird domes and tower, almost like a watchtower. And you can you can actually see different rooms. And, I mean, to me, there, there's too many... There's too many shapes and there's too much geography there. It doesn't look natural, okay? And again, it's very beautiful to look at. Um, you know, when I saw it, I just kind of stared at it for a while. I was like, wow, that is, that is absolutely beautiful. But, uh, I mean, right there, there's the original image right there. I did add a little bit of a filter, but like I said, at the end of the video, I'm going to show you the original NASA image untouched untouched and also we're going to zoom in here in a minute and uh you know get a really a, a good close look at it you know um because you know you guys know i do everything i can to to show you every bit of detail i mean right there guys here we go we're going to zoom in a little bit <clears throat> i mean that to me i don't know that does not look natural and why why would something like that be float literally floating in space right and right there, you see that little tower? And is that like a little moon? Maybe they have two moons behind them. It looks like a city. You know, like something you would see like on Google Maps. I mean, totally crazy. Like there's a little tunnel right there, some caves and um, almost like a V-shaped roof back there. You know, some type of awning. I don't know, guys. I mean, you tell me. You tell me what you think in the comment section because, you know, I, I, I'm completely blown away here. You know, and, and when you put all the facts together, the fact that it was leaked, okay, NASA tried to classify the picture, right? They tried to hide the picture from the public, but it was too late. Reporters already had their hands on it. And by the way, you know, it's kind of buried on the internet. Pay attention to what he said, because his father used to work for NASA, and NASA would withhold images from the public. They didn't want anyone seeing these images. But this image right here is the one that got leaked in 1994. Now, the fact that this is a confirmed leak image from NASA and that the Hubble Space Telescope took this image, this holds some weight to it. And I'm finding it hard not to believe. But I'm going to do some digging and see what I can find. All you got to do is continue to pay attention because things are getting weird.